Hello movie lovers, Bob for Bob's movie review here and today I'm bringing you my review of Dreamland. This one will be available on digital November 17th and was provided to me for review by Paramount Pictures. This one is rated R. It is a drama thriller with a one hour and 41 minute runtime. It is directed by Miles Joris Parafidi. It stars Marco Robbie and Travis Fimmel. So this movie is about uh, a family and really a whole town in the 1930s in Texas. They've come to kind of settle the land and uh, the weather goes really bad. There's a lot of dust storms and there's a drought for like a year, I think it is. And so the people can't really grow any crops and storms keep coming and kind of like taking out their shelter. And so a lot of people have given up and moved on to California and a lot of other people are trying to do the same. So then there's this character played by Margot Robbie who is a bank robber and she's involved in a robbery and there's a shootout and she kind of escapes to this family's farm. And she really kind of takes advantage of him and manipulates him. You know, he's a young man and she's an attractive older woman and she kind of uses her charms to get him to help her out. And we hear her story of what happened and slowly throughout the movie, we get more and more glimpses of what actually happened during this bank robbery. And so like everybody else, his family is kind of uh not not doing real well although his stepdad does have a job um you know they're they're thinking i think too maybe about moving to california i can't remember if they're going to move to california but everyone seems to be moving to california and so she tells him if you can get me to mexico i will give you twenty thousand dollars and he says well that's double your reward and she says well yeah that way you won't turn me in so he's got to get a car and he's got to like keep her hidden in the barn and not let anybody find out she's there because his stepdad's a cop and you know they're working the case and so there's kind of like all these uh, moving parts but he's trying to get a car so they can get to mexico and the whole time you know he's kind of like romantically interested in her obviously and um he believes his real dad is in mexico so he kind of wants to go anyways to go look for his real dad. You know guys, I thought this was a really, really interesting movie. Um, I love the performances all around, such superb acting in this movie, and I really enjoyed the story, and I thought it was a really fun movie. Like, I was definitely surprised at how much uh, I enjoyed this one. Um, just really well done. The ending to me, I was kind of like, oh, it's so predictable. The ending's gonna be so predictable. But it didn't quite end exactly how I was expecting. And it was a, a very interesting thing. I think they kind of were trying to make it out to be like a Bonnie and Clyde type of thing, but they even like uh, briefly mentioned Bonnie and Clyde. So it wasn't like they were trying to like duplicate it, but it was kind of like, this was like a, a goal or a dream of the time is to, to kind of be these outlaws. And that's kind of what they were going for in the story. And you know what, guys, it's just a really enjoyable movie and I, I really enjoyed it. I highly recommend it. I gave it a four out of five. Hope you guys did enjoy the video or you can find more information on Dreamland down description below. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos, check the chess videos and for more movie news, check out my website, bobsmoviereview.com. And I'll see you guys next time.